Right, today with another Everybody eBikes product profile, we're now talking about the Hooker Orthros. So again, Hooker is a company based in the Netherlands. We're the uh, exclusive agent for Hooker in Australia. So we bring these bikes in. This one uh, is the side-by-side -side tandem, if you like, uh, bike. So two people can ride the bike, one person steers. In this case, uh, the steering is on the left-hand side because it's a European bike and they steer on the left, but the new ones that we're bringing in, which will be here uh, early next year, will have the steering on the right. But in this case, yes, steering on the left here, so this person can steer. Both people can pedal. Uh, it, the bike is quite nice in that it comes with different pedaling modes. So the pilot person here, oh, sorry, not the pilot, this is the co-pilot person, they have the option with different modes, so I can put it in mode one here. So in this mode, this person can do whatever they want and it doesn't affect uh, what, the, what the pilot's doing. So if there's a sort of rider who's not gonna really concentrate and wants to do all sorts of things, they can just sit here and do whatever they want. In mode two, we can, they can help to push the bike. So they can, ooh, it's a bit hard by myself. They can pedal the bike or they can coast and that person can pedal. So it's just like a standard bike and in mode three uh, if this person was pedaling then you see that the pedals go together so in this mode the person if they're not able to pedal they don't know how to pedal then when the pilot is pedaling these pedals will go around and, and at least they get the feeling of, of pedaling as well it also has another feature which is not actually on this bike at the moment but it has a uh, a foot plate that is normally positioned in here is in the vertical position the foot plate can be rotated down so it can sit down here and if the person doesn't want to pedal at all they can just put their feet on the foot plate and have a rest uh, as you can see here we've got a couple of different not sure why but we've got a couple of different styles of pedals on this bike at the moment just for the last person that rode it must have needed a, a special pedal on one side so we can do all sorts of things with pedals as well comes with armrest Quite a nice feature in that it um, has the ability to turn the seat 90 degrees so if you're trying to load someone onto the bike it's easy to get them on and then you can rotate them around into position this is particularly useful we have a number of people on this bike where they get seizures and so they want the rider and family want to be able to get the person off quickly so they can rotate them around get them off the bike without anything being in the way also, as you'll notice, there's only a centre frame here, so it's very clear access for getting into the bike. There's no having to, normally you might have a frame here and you have to step over the frame, but in this one, you've got nice clear access to get on and off the bike. Uh, you can also move the seats backwards and forwards as well. So you can adjust the seat position. We can put a higher backrest on this. We've put four point harnesses on this. You can have a a seat belt, retractable seat belt on it. So you can do all the sort of postural support type things that we can do on some of the other bikes. Uh, it obviously has power assist uh, as well. So that makes it a bit easier for the pilot to, uh, if they are, if this person, if their if they're co-pilot person isn't really riding that much and helping that much, then the pilot can, uh, you know, use the power assist here and adjust the power levels as they would normally. So you can go right down to zero, no, no assist. So you can both be actually riding and getting some, you know, getting a bit of exercise, but then you can bring the level up to help you as you're riding. The good thing about these side-by-side trikes -side is that anybody can be a pilot on the bike. You don't have to, you know, with an inline tandem uh, type a two-wheel bike, you know, both people have to be pretty good uh, when they're uh, riding the bike together because of the balance and understanding what's going on. With a side-by-side, -side, it's very easy for anyone to get on the bike and be the pilot, so it's great for um, you know carers family other family members whatever can all just get on and ride the bike with with the co-pilot so we have people you know a lot of um, we have some people with vision impairment intellectual disabilities dementia things like that parkinson's you know it's, it's very nice and because you're social it, it, because you're beside the person then it's a very social uh, interaction rather than having the person in front of you or the person behind you you've actually got them right beside you really good to connect with them you can keep an eye on them if, if you know if they do have a seizure or something you can see them straight away what's going on and we've seen you know a number of children where they like they really like being beside the parent they can hold on to them while they're riding they're not going to want to get off the bike because they, they they're very well you know 
connected and engaged with what's going on. And once they're moving, you know, it's great. Even if they're not pedaling, they can still um, enjoy just, just being on the bike, riding around. As you can see, very easy to, to control the bike. You know, you don't need any sort of uh, experience or particular training to be able to uh, ride the bike around and control the bike. So great for, you know, a whole range of people to be able to get on and, um, and enjoy uh, being out and getting and, and riding. Obviously, it's a bit wider than a, than a standard bike. I think it's just over, it's 1.1 meters across here. In fact, the handlebars are slightly wider than, than the bike. Um, so, you know, you do need a reasonable path to be able to ride on. I mean, you can ride on the road as well. Um, but, you know, very stable as well because of that width. You're not going to tip the bike over um, when when you're when you're riding around. We have, um, you know, you, you do probably need a trailer or a big van to be able to transport it. But uh, you know, it's a great it's a great bike for for people who you know want to take someone else with them who can't necessarily ride by themselves. But you still want to be able to to be engaged and uh, and enjoy getting out and riding a bike. Thank you.